It's cold here. It's been cold. Had a cold night. But uh, the ground is still kind of warmish. And I think this here indicates where the sun hits it. Uh, this line from the, sh the house shades it. But the sun hits it here, so that's a little warmer. And then uh, I put salt down and... Uh, the air temperature is really at the air at the edge of when salt can even work, but uh, I think because the ground temperature is still warm, uh, it started working immediately. And I don't put much down either. I just put a little sprinkle down. But uh, the, the grass isn't really, uh, the grass isn't frozen. I, can, I can't, I don't know how I could show you. Everything else is frozen though. I mean water's, for all the water's frozen. But the ground, the ground is still a little bit warm. It continues to amaze me in this winter landscape, what I do, that uh, these ducks just love to play in the mud. They don't care if it's cold. Now they're going to go away. I have to give these ducks water and uh, I had some, I actually gave them water yesterday but I had some problems like one thing the drain hose is frozen so I had to have a different method of sealing it. It didn't work, that tank leaks and I'm redoing it and I've got a trench there when I dump the water it can go out that trench without the, when I dump it without the drain hose. and. Uh, but these ducks, they just love to play in the mud and the water. And there's, they were all over there now. They're, since I've got the camera out, they don't want to do it. But see how he, they, li they like the muddy water better than the fresh water, at least. They like all kinds of water, though. When I get this filled up, they'll go swimming, most likely, in their fresh water. They, I guess they like to taste all different kinds of water between fresh and just mud, just absolute slurry mud. Somebody gave us that white duck. For no good reason, except they didn't want it. But he doesn't, he's not too much of a, he's not a problem, I guess, so. You'd think their feet would get cold anyway. You can understand. <laughs> See, you, can, you can understand it. Okay, their body's got enough feathers and duck down and everything. And the oil keeps the water off. But you'd think their feet would get cold anyway. They don't have anything on their feet. There's got to be blood and muscles in there. They have little tiny claws, which helps them on the ice. Work. And then we gave them this. It's really not terribly cold right now. We made a shelter for them, but they don't want to go in it generally. Now one of them, of course, make a liar out of me. He's peeking in there. But it's not even very cold. It's Well, it's, it's just around freezing right now, but it'll get down to zero and they won't go in there. At least they haven't really to speak of. Like you'd think they'd huddle up in there is what we were thinking. And we had more of a roof on it. Of course the more roof there is the less they want to go in there. Thank you.
I got fish in here, and I figured out a way to. Uh, sometimes you can see them swimming, but I don't see them now. They're in there. Though it looks like you see them now, but I think those are just leaves. But they look kind of like that, except they swim. But uh, I figured out a way to get heat in there through those air bubblers because I've got a little bit here in this tile. So I've got air bubble in that tile. So there's a little heat. And then for the uh, ducks, I've got a heater. A traditional, I actually have a traditional heater in there, but it doesn't seem to be working. But this is a, for the ducks, I've got a traditional uh, farmer water trough heater. It'll keep the, uh, it'll keep this uh, from freezing. So I'm done right here for now. These goats are in the garage, which stays remarkably warm considering everything, but it's below those windows, it's dirt. I mean, yeah, and then the doors are insulated. That whole wall is underground. And then this wall is the house, so I guess that's what does it. Snow plowing again. One thing uh, I'm gonna show you, I figured out when you, I got some gravel, and you can't hardly snow plow gravel, but if you go backwards, it works a little bit. So there you can see I'm back, back plowing, you might say. See, uh, actually this one I could go forward. the grass. The wind hurts, 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 hurts. It helps. I was going to say, if nothing else, it helps you see where the road is, but it's still kind of hard to see where it is. I got to get, I got to get that minivan going, because I can put chains on it. I won't put chains on it unless I have to. I got to get fuel for my track. The ducks get a can of peas every night. That's their bedtime treat. It's 20 degrees out here tonight. Chickens are getting uh, tomatoes tonight.
give him all these tomatoes, dude. The snow is scrunching in Kentucky. Cows are waiting to get fed over there.